Are you guys hungry? I'm pretty hungry. What's up, Wolfpack Nation? Thanks for watching Wolfpack Sports TV. I'm Abby Labar with your Week in Review. <music> NC State men's club basketball team took the win against Ridgeview Prep Wednesday night. With a final score of 82 to 70, the Wolfpack proved to be the stronger team both on offense and defense throughout the entire game. The Wolfpack kept an average of a 12-point lead throughout most of the game. Ridgeview had several shots, but just could not seem to find a good rhythm, only making about 50% of them. The Wolfpack adjusted to this situation by playing a very strong rebound game, giving them the advantage on several turnovers. Women's soccer lost both of their matches this past week. The first game had a result of a 1-0 loss against Louisville. According to GoPack.com, Coach Santoro had good things to say about the Wolfpack's performance. However, they couldn't seem to find a way to get any of their shots in the net down near the goal. A tough battle against number one Virginia resulted in a 7-1 loss last night. Women's soccer plays number 22 Duke Sunday, November 1st. Men's soccer fell to number 12 Syracuse on Friday after a strong defensive showout. The Wolfpack was able to hold a team that outshot them for the first half of the game. The latter half of the game was where we saw all of the action when Zach Knudsen pulled the pack ahead 1-0. Unfortunately, the Wolfpack could not hold them. Syracuse scored the equalizer and the winning goal only 10 minutes apart to secure the win. Men's soccer is at home tomorrow, Friday, against Clemson at 7 p.m. Now it is time for some Wolfpack football. The Wolfpack secured their first win in Winston-Salem since 2001. 35-17, the Pack proved themselves with a strong offensive performance. The Pack had a total of 475 offensive yards to Wake Forest's 271. I cannot wait for the Halloween game against undefeated Clemson on Saturday. I've heard a lot of doubts about the outcome of the game, but with NC State's pass of showing out for these big games, I have a feeling this could be a pretty good one. I hope to see you guys all at Carter Finley on Saturday. That's all I have for you guys. Thanks for watching Wolfpack Sports TV. I'm Abby Labar bringing you into the pack. Are you guys hungry? I'm pretty hungry. Oh, awesome. Great, I'm starving. <laughs>